this year the hype was VR AR glasses all over the actual CES 2024 so I hit the floor and I choose the best one and X real was so far um, ahead of the, its uh, competitors so this year I'm gonna end up getting the AR glasses for home use and game use so let's take a look at the actual AR glasses first hand during CES 2024 I was introduced to X real which I knew about it but I they was introduced to X real 2 pro and was you know i was okay in the edge of buying or not but after going through it and looking at the demo i ended up purchasing it and here it is we're going to open it up and see what you get when you get something like this beautiful presentation if you guys can see the box itself i love this whole representation now uh this is the glasses they're embedded in here so um around it you get other stuff here you get instructions you get the different lenses that you're going to require, different um, actual pieces for your nose, and included a cloth. As you guys see that everything's in here, and that's pretty much it. What you get. So let's open the glasses. All right, there's the glasses themselves. All right, uh, I'm not going to be able to show you everything in the glasses themselves because uh, it's very hard to capture any of the stuff in there. But I'm going to show you, try to demo some of the stuff for you. And tell you um, step by step uh, what I'm looking at and what you can do. Now, first of all, out of the box, uh, they're ready to go. All you have to do is plug them in pretty much. And they do have um, audio controls. They have uh, lighting controls, meaning that you could actually um, darken the actual lens if anything is bothering you. Um, at the moment, wherever you look, the screen is going to be looking at. But if you buy an additional uh, attachment for this, you're able to control the screen where it stands in one place. So just like the Apple glasses that are just out there, um, you can use them similar to it. Now, I do wear glasses to begin with. All right. You can wear these with glasses, but there's better options. They do sell prescription glasses for this lens. All right. For the Android, you're supposed to go get the nebula application all right so we're going to install that so we can actually do the updates and control the actual um some of the settings in here so we're going to go ahead and do that all right according to this we did an update on it uh down by download the application so we're going to wait and see what's the next step so i like about the glasses this is what i like about them they have a cover in case you want to get darker as it is and um, i'm going to show you a little bit with this camera i have a little tiny camera and turn it on and I'm going to try to see if I can show you some of the inside that I, I can see on the camera. So let me bring it up to you and I'm going to show you a couple of features with it and you can see in depth. All right. First of all, on the colors, if you guys can see the dark, this is the, how dark you get. But if you push the button, let me see if I can push the button here. There's one tone. If you guys can see it. Two. And then three. It's pretty much how dark it gets on the actual... The lens, if you guys can see some of the stuff, the features, you can see my full screen on it. Uh, and, and it looks freaking awesome on it. I mean, the quality of it. Uh, what I want to do, I, I want to get play games. That's what I actually want to do this for. So we're going to put it for gaming. A couple of things you should know on the actual system here itself. There is a little area. That it's a sensor. It knows that you're having on or not. And if you guys notice, the glasses just turn, change color. So the sensor itself, you have to put something in there and it turns dark back to it was. Um, it, and it's a cord running all the way down to my um, phone, if you guys can see it. And you can actually see somebody, if I put my phone here, my, my settings here, my camera, you guys can see a little bit of the inside of the camera, both, both lenses. And um, you could walk with this around throughout the day, but it's a little hard to see something in front of you. So just to be aware that if you let it go, it's going to change back to where it was. All right, we're going to actually test these out now with the actual iPad. So let's go ahead and test them out and see how well they work. All right, so I wear glasses and I, I still can see pretty good with it, but I recommend you getting maybe the additional add-ons for the glasses, you can do that. They have um, different sizes in the actual box. There's a smaller and a larger one. 
So I'm going to stick with this one. It actually is adjustable. You could adjust it to your nose, however you want it. Um, once in a while, you do have to clean it up because you or your lens is going to get dirty. That's why they give you a little cloth here. Don't use your any kind of other device to clean this stuff, all right? Because it's very fragile. Uh, adjusting, there's a couple levels. There's only three levels. You go, go up and down. That's pretty much it, you know, on that part. Now, bottom wise, you got your screen um, brightness here and actually the tinted also. Now, if you want to lower down the volume, you can do it by holding down the button and then controlling the volume. Speakers, let me disconnect it from here. Speakers are hidden here, right next to your ear and the bottom here too. You can see two areas, the top and the bottom of it. So see, they're, they're very loud. It has, it's, but the only problem is that people are going to hear it as soon as you hit it really loud. So if you want to sync it up with your uh, existing Bluetooth, that's probably a better option. Um, I like that they give you an extra cover here, which is great because you don't want to scratch these glasses too. You want to use them as regular glasses if you want. If you're wearing contacts or so forth, you can do that. And they give you a cloth to clean them up. And you could brighten them and darken them too. Uh, but you are going to require power when you're doing that. Um, in front of it, it's going to block your view from this section. So you are can't be really walking around with these in, in an area where there's a lot of people. Because you're going to bump into people. It gets a little, you know, there's some blind spots here that you're going to require that, to take them off or walk around. Now, when you have this on, you can't see anything. You definitely have to take them off. Be careful on that. One type USB. Now they do have different features. They have adapters for if you have a, an actual iPhone and if you have a Thunderbolt connection, they do have that. But my recommendation, I'm going to buy an add-on and we're going to add it to the next video of what I'm going to buy and add this so I could play PlayStation. Right now, I could plug this directly to my Steam Deck and it works directly with it. Now, just be sure that this is going to power it up and I actually also uh, uh bring in the video card into it so just be assured of that um so try not to lose it the rest of it's nylon they give you about 67 feet of the cord and of course you know you can't go wrong of which is left and right there's only one way to put them on the lenses themselves are really thick in the front you guys can see that and you can see how the mirror actually works with it so it displays on the bottom and it bounces through the front so very simple We'll put this to use a lot more. Maybe eat it, even edit videos and stuff like that through here. But uh, the quality is really good, really sharp. It's a, it's more like a 1080. It's not a 4K yet, but it's getting there. All right, the Steam Deck works very well with it. I mean, I'm very impressed with it. Uh, it plays with the Steam Deck. Um, enjoying a new game with it is a it's a whole different experience. If you guys can see. Um, I could take this pretty much anywhere. It's going to power it up for a couple of hours. Enjoy myself. Um, very simple to install. Just one cable. Easy to use. I hope you guys enjoy the video.